Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwa and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my weekly Sunday vlog for May 7, 2017. In this video, I'm going to tell you guys what's been going on with me for the past week. And uh, this past week, I played Hitman uh, on, uh, on PS4, the complete first season. I got the Steelbook Edition right here. All right? I'm going to, I'm loading up a save game because I want to show you the craziness I experienced playing this game. Oh man! <laughs> Look at that pile of bodies, man. Oh my gosh. All these dudes. <laughs> I just stood right here and all the enemies started coming in. I just dragged them all into this room. But man, I took down everyone, man. There's not, not a single... Uh, no one can hurt me. I can go through the rest of this mission without any problems. <laughs> but that's not it. Here, let me show you this other save game. Where is it? Uh, I need to press start there. Load. I did it again for a different location. S same mission. This this is the last mission of the game, by the way. I was like, I keep getting spotted, and people would keep seeing me as suspicious, and you know, I was like, you know what? Screw it. Let's just <laughs> just take over the entire facility, including the targets I'm supposed to take. I take down. All right. Anyway. I did finish Hitman uh, for the uh, PlayStation 4, the episodic game that came out last year for 2016. Okay, They released it physically this past J uh, January, so I, I picked it up, played it, just, just finished it. Oh, here it is! The alarm's going off and such. Here, let me pull down the... Oh, yeah! Look at all those bodies. I'm crazy, man. Sounds like there's one more agent out there. One more uh, enemy to take down. But anyway, now that all the enemies are dead, here, I'm, I'm trying to control with one hand, by the way. I can finally take down the dude in here. See, he's red. He's my target. Nothing can stop me now. <laughs> so anyway, I, I beat the game. I, I enjoyed it. Of course, this is, not the, this is not the way you're supposed to play the game. You're supposed to play with stealth. Uh, not so many casualties, you know? Uh, try to beat it with uh, the best score and such like that, but uh, I was like, man, that's what everyone else is doing. I'm gonna go all out and be be a crazy mofo in the game. <laughs> so there it is, Hitman. I played every single Hitman game, by the way. Here's the Hitman series. Okay, another one to add to the collection, and I did make a, a, a review separately of, of this, by the way. <clears throat> when it comes to movies, this past week, what I watch. Um, here's my ticket stub. Went to see Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2. I have a magazine to show you. Where is it? Here. This is from uh, Entertainment Weekly. Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2. I enjoyed the game, man. It, it was, um, uh, not the game, the, the movie. Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2. I went to see it with my dad. It was my birthday yesterday, by the way. My birthday, so this is one of the things we did. We ate out. We ate at an Italian restaurant, high-class Italian restaurant called CC's Pizza. <laughs> and then we, uh... We went to, to see uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, <clears throat> and the uh, movie was, was uh, it's visually appealing. Even when there, there was like a scene where the, um, uh, the arrow was going around and it was like killing all the dudes, and the, the dudes were just falling down from the sky, and even that looked, looked pretty, you know? <laughs> like, like they, they, the movie was visually appealing, it looked very, very nice to, to look at, right? Um, good special effects, you know? They had exotic planets and stuff like that. Remember that one one enemy we couldn't find? He found me. <laughs> so uh, so yeah, we, we saw Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, and th th that's honestly the only movie I saw this past week. Oh, um, Hitman! If you buy the Steelbook Edition, they actually come with a code for you to download a documentary about the making of the game, and it also has included the um, the official soundtrack. So uh, if you want, want to watch those, uh, it, it's a uh, you know put in the code and stuff like that, and, you know, you'll get it. I watched the documentary for a little bit. Uh, I didn't watch the whole thing, but it, it was really interesting. It has, like, oh, they were discussing with each other. Should they make it episodic or not? Do people even want an episodic Hitman game and stuff like that? And they touched on everything, like reactions to the trailer at E3 and uh, 
And uh, after they were finished with the game, you know, when they made the game and it's out for sale and it's on PlayStation Store or Xbox, uh, uh, whatever, you know, um, they uh, they had a little banquet, you know, had a, a huge dinner with all their families and stuff like that. That was really cool, you know. So uh, anyway, if, if you're interested in watching that documentary, it's short, but, uh, but yeah. And honestly, that, that's kind of it. Like yesterday, we, went to, we ate that uh, pizza and uh, saw the movie, you know, I've been playing this all weekend. And um, this upcoming week, a couple, a couple videos I want to upload, uh, they're, they're already scheduled on YouTube, by the way. Aliens, Alien Covenant comes out next week, right? So um, I've made an Alien Collection video, that's coming up soon. And then we had another video where I'm, I'm putting on my cap and gown, I'm actually graduating next week from uh, KU. And I put, I put on uh, my, my cap and gown, everything was like, like not, not the right way and stuff like that. So that video is coming up this week also. So a lot of you guys are probably watching it and be like, David, you're wearing it wrong. I know. <laughs> um, it's kind of like a present for myself, I bought this. I, I, just because it's this year seems to be the year of WWE for me, so I, I bought this this kid belt, right? It's small. I saw at Toys R Us like a two hundred dollar belt. It's like life size, you know, just like the ones that you see on on, on the in, in matches and such, right? And it, it was beautiful, <laughs> but it's like it, it's really big. Um, stopped by Family Video. I got this. Billy Lynn, uh, Billy Lynn's uh, long halftime walk has Vin Diesel. It has um. Chris Tucker in it, and of course, her. <laughs> so that's why I want to watch this movie. I mean, sure, um, I I haven't watched it yet, by the way. But uh, oh, Steve Martin's in this also. Okay. Yeah, he's right there. Steve Martin. We see Vin Diesel. We see Chris Tucker. I don't know these other other people. So anyway, I'll watch this movie sometime this next upcoming week. But uh, all right, you guys probably want to do the uh, Q and A. Every single week, uh, I ask people to ask me questions rather than just shout-outs, right? <clears throat> um, so, let's check out what, what you guys asked me in last week's vlog. I'll answer in this week's vlog, okay? And if you want, go ahead and answer, you know, ask your questions in this week's vlog, and I'll answer it next week. Where is it? Here it is, vlog. <clears throat> By the way, my graduation will be live streamed. Like, the University of Kansas, they live stream the graduation ceremonies, so... I don't know if you'll be able to see me, but if you pay attention, I should be graduating sometime between 10.30... 12 o'clock. Between those times, right? Some... T they're gonna, like, name every... Like, the, the, the million students, man! I, I, like, thousands! So, <laughs> eventually they'll get to my name. I don't know if you'll, you'll see it, but... But, yeah. Uh... You didn't say goodbye... You know. Can we play games on stream sometime? O on Steam sometimes? Uh, I guess we could. Uh, my computer lags though, so I may drop from the match or something. You'd be like, oh, I'm not, never gonna play with David again. From that, but that's from Nerdcraft uh, for the win. Um, Chris Abbott asks, will you be taking Titus to Texas with you? He's already there. Like, he's not my dog. He's my, he's my sister's dog. My sister lives in Texas, so that's where he is right now. HMC Kenna09. Can I have a shout out? Yeah, sure. Shout out to you, Harry. Yeah. Um, what's your favorite Call of Duty game? I like 2 and World of War, so I'm looking forward to World War 2 this year. Because it's, it's, it's taking them during that time period that I really enjoy. <clears throat> Q&A, The King, what is your worst game ever? Wait, uh, and that, uh, uh, that's from Jay Darby, the one who asked me about the Call of Duty question. Jay Darby. The King asked, what is your worst game ever? I didn't like Sniper Ghost Warrior 1 on Xbox 360. I played on PS3, I didn't have as much glitches and, you know, it didn't bug out on me and freeze my system and stuff like that. But when I played the same game, uh, Sniper Ghost Warrior, uh, the first one, on Xbox 360, it's like bugs and glitches and frame rate drops and oh my gosh, it was crazy, man. So that's gotta be my the worst game for me. All right. Um, I guess that's all the questions. Brian Pinnock, you live in KC? Cause I live in KC. Well, I live close to KC. At least I did anyway. I'm moving out of my apartment next this week uh, for for you guys. Uh, this week I'm I'm going to move out. So. 
I'll be back here full time, live streaming all the time, and looking for jobs and whatever, you know? So, yeah. The next game I really want to play is Mafia 3. I'm trying to look for that game. Final Fantasy XV is a game that's on my radar, too. But Sniper Ghost Warrior 3 just came out. I, I, I do, I do want to play that game, but... With the, my, my experience with the series, I want to wait till like, it goes down in price a little bit. Actually, I have Destiny. I need to play that game. I bought that game when it was like 10 bucks. Now, if you want to buy it, it's like $5. So, I could have just waited. But I bought the game back when it was like 10, 10 bucks, you know, $9.99. And, um... I didn't pop it in, I didn't install it, I never played a, a single mission from, from the game. And now, if I want to play the like, I could have just waited a little longer and just got even, even cheaper than I did at the time, you know? So, anyway, that, that is week for my weekly vlog. Thank you for watching. Rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Bye.